Hello, good morning, good. Hello and good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Firstly, I would like to say thank you for having us at this conference. We are representing Cunningham Vocational College, Sabah, Malaysia. My name is Kamaru Nazira Taib. With me are my teammates, Mohamed Alfian and Ardama Hubuan. Today, we'll be presenting our final year project, which is known as Fast Mass Disposable Machine. Face masks have become something common that many people will wear when they go to certain places, even after this pandemic is totally over. These, when they go to the certain places, these masks can be decontaminated properly with typical cleaning items. They are masks can be, they are being thrown away just like that when they might still harbor viruses or bacteria that can result in the spread of any disease. So we designed this. So we designed. So we designed this decontamination machine to help clean the mass from harming the environment and the people. This machine consists of four components, and they are spray, play with laminate, and a sterilizing chemical to terminate bacteria and viruses. This is the problem statement. Since the pandemic struck in the year 2020, face masks have become a common medical protection that people wear in the public. Public space in order to reduce the risk of contracting any virus pathogen, any virus pathogen that can spread through the air, through the liquid and air. We have seen how significant face masks were when COVID-19 became a pandemic. However, most of these face masks are disposed directly into dustbin, which will eventually end, end in landfill without being decontaminated properly. It is likely that the pathogen is still in the mask. This can pose danger to the people and animals around when they are exposed to the contaminated germs. Next, my friend will, will be presenting the objective of our final year project. Good evening, my name is Adama Huan. Now I'm talking about the objective. We have several objectives. The first one was to create a machine that can properly contaminate gas mass in an efficient and safer manner. Our second objective was to prevent any possible way for the virus to spread from use protection products such as masks. Last but not least, our third objective was to analyze how will the public respond to this project, to this machine, especially in deciding whether, whether, it, whether it could really benefit the community. Okay. In the long run, we want to expand the range of products that can contaminate, con contaminate through this machine, such as, and maybe we can make it machine run automatically with need for human to operate it. We also plan to use chemicals then what we are using now, which, which is basically a uh, type of bleach. We feel the need to improve the aesthetic appearance of the machine so that it can appeal to many people. Next. In con conclusion, we hope this product can be manufactured in a large quantity and used widely in any public buildings and public space that are usually occupied by crowds of people such as airports, hospitals, 
and school where masks are mandatory. And now, my friend will continue about the interior parts. Good evening. Uh, my name is Alvian. I will be presenting the interior parts of the project. First of the plywood that we use as the base of our project so that it can strongly hold the motor pump spray. The insertion area is the place where we put the mask, mask in. We also create a specific spot for the decontamination chemical that will be pumped from a medium-sized container. Thank you for listening. This is the, the exterior of our project. And this is the video that, that showed that how this machine works. Good morning. I'm sorry. That is the end of our presentation. Thank you for having us and thank you for the attention. Any other presenter have any questions?